and welcome to the family entertainment edition of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? I'm sure you're keen to get into that hot seat, so let's get started. Okay, let's take a quick check on the rules. Up to four of you can play the game and each of you will need to choose adult or junior questions. Then for the first time ever, you'll be able to choose the type of questions you'd like to answer. There are three categories, general knowledge, entertainment, and sport. Simply choose one and stick with it. All you need to do then is answer the 15 questions that stand between you and a virtual one million pounds. As always, you can walk away at any time and there are the usual three lifelines available to you. Ask the audience, 50-50, and phone a friend. If you make it all the way to a million, you could be jetting off on a luxurious family holiday by entering our competition. So grab your remote control and let's play. Who wants to be a millionaire? Select the difficulty and category of questions you'd like to play. Sir, you want to answer the traditional general knowledge questions. Good choice. Let's see how far up the money tree you can go, starting with five questions to get you up to £1,000. Right, here is your first question for £100. That's right, for £100. A nice easy question for £200. Very good, that's right. Now you've not used any lifelines, so they are still all available if you need them on this £300 question. You're right, well done. Question number four is for 500 quid. You seem pretty sure that that was the right answer. And rightly so, it is, well done. This is the last chance that you could leave us with absolutely nothing. Please don't do that. Here comes question number five. Aha! Audience, time for you to get involved and help win us a bit of cash. Have a look at the question and vote A, B, C or D on your keypads. All vote now. Well, I'd be happy with that result, I think. But are you happy now that D is the correct answer? Well, that was the last chance you could leave with nothing. And you won't be. Well done. It's the right answer. Well done. £1,000 safely in the bank. But I don't want to give you that just yet. Take a look at the next question. It's worth £2,000. Take your time. You can still use your 50-50 or phone a friend if you don't know the answer. Well done, you just won yourself £2,000. OK, a chance to double that £2,000 to £4,000 now with question number seven. The very best of luck, here it comes. You had £2,000. I can tell you, it was the right answer. You doubled your money to £4,000. Well, you're making very good progress, and you're now just three questions away from securing yourself a guaranteed £32,000. The first of those questions is worth £8,000. However, you would lose £3,000 if you gave me the wrong answer. Well, I don't blame you for using a lifeline if you're not sure. Pick one of your friends and we'll give them a call. Great. 
great, I'm really pleased you picked me. The answer is B. Nice and easy, that one. So your friend thinks the answer is B. Are you happy to go with B? If this is wrong, you lose £3,000. But it's not wrong, you just won 8000 OK, things are getting a little bit more serious now. £16,000 is a lot of money. And that's how much you can win by giving me the right answer to question number nine. The drop, if you get this wrong, though, has gone up to 7000 So think carefully before you give me an answer. You're right, you've just won £16,000. Right, this is a very serious moment. You have £16,000. If you do get the next question right, you'll definitely be leaving with no less than £32,000. Give me a wrong answer, though, and you have to take a drop of 15000 Not good. I really do wish you the very best of luck. Here comes question number 10. OK, you want to use your 50-50 lifeline. Computer, can you take away two wrong answers for us, please? Has the 50-50 helped you win £32,000? It certainly has. Well played. You can breathe a sigh of relief now. You will not be leaving with anything less than £32,000. And you might as well play the next question, as you now have nothing to lose. Get this right, and I'll be giving you £64,000. Have a look. Here it comes. I know you have nothing to lose, but are you sure that is the answer you want to go with? Well, you had £32,000. You now have £64,000. What a performance this is turning out to be. Brilliant. Right, the prize increases really kick in now. The next question is worth £125,000. And believe it or not, you are only four correct answers away from winning one million. You will lose 32,000 if you give me a wrong answer and you've used up all three of your lifelines. Right, let's not waste any time. I have to tell you that you gave me the right answer. Fantastically well played. You just won 125,000 pounds. You could be about to lose £93,000 if you give me the wrong answer to this question. If you give me a correct answer, you'll win a quarter of a million pounds. Now, I would much rather that happened. The very best of luck to you. Let's have a look at question number 13 of a possible 15. You're playing for very big money here, so is that your final answer? Right, this is serious business. You've just decided to play on a question for a quarter of a million pounds. I can tell you. It's the right answer. You are a quarter of a millionaire. Wow, this is a superb performance. I've just written you out a virtual check for £250,000. Now, hopefully, you can go further. I'm about to ask you a question worth half a million pounds. 500000 Remember, you have used up all your lifelines, so it would be a serious risk 
to just guess at this stage as you would lose £218,000. Have a look at the question. It's number 14 of a possible 15. You just risked £218,000. You had a quarter of a million. You now have half a million. Amazing. You are one of our biggest ever winners. Right, here we go then. This is your one and perhaps only ever chance to win one million pounds. You have no lifelines left, so you are either going to have to make a complete guess or, of course, you may well just know the answer. I should remind you of the massive amount of money you could lose, but think of what you could win. The best of luck, everybody here is rooting for you. On which Mediterranean island is the volcano Mount Etna? Sicily, Crete, Corsica, Sardinia. And I have to check that you are really going to play this question. Is this your final answer? Amazingly, you have decided to play the million pound question. Now, you could have walked away with half a million pounds, but instead, you are walking away with one million pounds. You're a winner, fantastically well done. Not only have you won a million, you've also got the chance to enter a draw to win a fantastic, all expensive paid family holiday. Just text the winning code to the number on your screen. Very well done and thanks for playing the family entertainment edition of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire?